It's your girl Ro in the building and I'm here to welcome you to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my Valentine's Day special edition. And in today's video, I am going to share with you how to create some edible chocolate covered strawberries. That's right. This video is sponsored by Icing Images and I'm gonna share with you how these delicious chocolate covered strawberries are wonderfully made. Now let's get into it. So brought to you by Icing Images, I am going to be using what is called a flex frost sheet, some chocolate that's already melted, and I'm gonna be using some paper potion to help with the application, which is also by Icing Images. A brush, my toothpicks, and my strawberries, already clean strawberries. So what you wanna do is make sure your strawberries are completely clean, removed any dead leaves, that are on your strawberries and if you want more information on how to clean your strawberries check out my other videos listed on my channel all right so after you dry make sure that your strawberries are completely dry by using a paper towel and dry them off very well now once you have done that take your toothpick and insert them in the top of your strawberry Now, once you have melted your chocolate for 30 second intervals, make sure your chocolate is nice and smooth. You wanna go ahead and dip. Scrape the bottom. And then place it onto your surface to dry. Now you wanna get you some edible scissors. I say edible scissors because that should be the scissors you're only using for your edible artwork or your edible arrangements. So here is the flex frost sheet and this is what I call a love print, but the name of this sheet is actually a graffiti print, which is listed on Ice and Images and I will leave all that information in the description box below. But you wanna cut you off an oversized piece to place it onto your strawberry so that it can be a complete fit. Once you have take your piece, you want to size it up with your strawberry. Take your scissors and do two cuts at the top. Now what I'm doing here is just sizing up the strawberry to make sure it is enough and it's going to lay completely flat onto the strawberry. Now I'm gonna take my paper potion and you want to spray the back of the flex frost sheet or you can also pour this in a cup and just take your brush and uh, just apply a thin application on the back of the flex frost sheet because what you don't wanna do is smear the image. All right, so you wanna make sure you have a good clean image and also you can spray the strawberry and just apply a thin application. You don't have to saturate it, just a thin application over the strawberry and then place your image right along the strawberry starting from the base and work your way up. Now you wanna make sure you have clean and dry hands to be sure you don't smear your image. All right, so what you see here is I'm applying the two sides. I wanna lay down the tip of the strawberry and then work my way up to the top. And you may have to hold in some areas so that it can lay. And then you're going to take the top, I call it the lip, the top lip, and then apply that onto the strawberry to close it in. Now I'm doing some a little bit of adjustment because you don't want any ripples or too many ripples into the print. You want it all to be nice and straight. Now 
Now, if there is a little bit of leakage, just dry your hands, dry the strawberry, and then continue with the application. This is completely edible and it does not taste like paper once you bite into the strawberries because it mends in with the chocolate and the strawberry. Now this print was done by Ice and Images and the Flex Frost is a shimmery, like a uh, uh, silver shimmery sheet and the print was designed right over the Flex Frost. So um, I will leave the link in the description box below so that you all can get this particular sheet. So now I'm gonna take the paper potion and just spray my brush to give another application to the lips so that I can seal the Flex Frost sheet. The Flex Frost is a edible sheet that's like fabric that is more flexible to use and able to lay more easy when it comes to decorating treats or cakes or whatever dessert you choose to use. Now I'm cutting a little bit of the image off because it's a little bit too much at the top. And what I'm doing is just working my magic, smoothing it out and holding it till it seals. All right. So just make sure once you're applying the image to um, the candy melt, because this is candy melts, you know, um, it's a candy coating um, chocolate. And I use Merkin's chocolates, as you all know. So whatever choice you use, whether it's candy melts or chocolate, it's your decision. But this is it. This is your chocolate covered edible strawberries and great for Valentine's Day. For watching my video and if you have enjoyed this video make sure you comment like and subscribe be sure to hit that notification bell to always let you know and it will remind you when my next video will post and if you enjoyed this video be sure to watch these next videos that you see here listed on my channel it's your girl robot to go and i'll see you in the next video